Hello friends, Heidi here from Rain Country. God is good all the time and I'm here for another frequently asked question and that is, where do I find seeds? Where I buy my seeds now has changed in this past year. Now my favorite place to buy seeds up until some really weirdness happened back in the beginning of this year it was baker creek and that's also known as rareseeds.com now i still think it's a great place to buy seeds but the reason i had to veer away from there is i'm sure many have noticed is that they're they've been having a really hard time keeping many of their seeds stocked for the same reason people are having a hard time finding jars, lids, vacuum seal lids, and much more. Even pressure canners and freezers people are having a hard time with. And so then I thought, well, duh, why am I not looking on Etsy? Because I personally sell quite a few seeds on Etsy, but obviously their seeds I don't sell are things that I'm not growing yet that I want to start growing. And so I've been going to Etsy and I think that's a number one place to look at because here's the great thing about that is you can no matter what country you're from or whatever state you're from if you're in the US you can try to look specifically for people who are selling seeds that are closer to your own area so before what I was doing was I was going to rareseeds.com and then if I couldn't find the seeds there, I'd go to Amazon and look there and buy from vendors, you know, because different private people sell through different places. Sometimes they th sell through Amazon, sometimes they sell through Etsy, sometimes they sell through eBay. There's many places to go. But I think you're just going to find a lot better selection by going to Etsy over that. And so I've just got a handful of some of the seeds I bought recently from Etsy for next year's garden 2021 you can look on there and you can find you know if one seller doesn't have it another one will again we're selling quite a few of our seeds and i still have more that i'll be adding as they're available and please understand i get a lot of people like for example at the time that i'm shooting this video i still don't have my valerian seed up because I thought I'd have it up by now, but it's still taking time to dry. I'm hoping by the time you see this video, it will be up, but no guarantees because I'm my videos are three to four weeks out, so it might be they might be ready by then. But it's t they're taking a lot longer to dry than I thought. Same thing with my yarrow seeds. I'm hoping I can have them up by the time you see this, but they might not be up. But just because I say I'm going to sell it. If you don't see them on the store, it just simply means they're not ready yet. Also, if you're seeing this much later, like maybe eight months down the road, I probably already put the seeds out up and they sold out because my seeds tend to sell very fast, especially lately, which thank you for all, to all those people who've been purchasing seeds through our store. So if you're interested in what we have available, uh, you can go into the description box down below. The first link you'll see is our Etsy store link. You can also wait to the end of this video and right about here you should see our little red nasturtium flower pop up. If you click on that, it will take you directly to our Etsy store. And then again, if you can't find what you're looking for there and you know that either I will have it available or did have it available, just send me a message through the Etsy store and ask me if or when they're going to be available again. Sometimes it, it might not be until next spring or next fall that you'll see them. If I don't have them, then just look around some more on Etsy and try to find places that are as local to you as you can. Now these particular seeds I got through a uh, a guy that sells them out of Idaho, which isn't super close to us, but a lot closer than other places, and they're in the Pacific Northwest, so I felt pretty good about these. To me, that's a pretty good purchase. Now, I have purchased seeds from people from across the country as well, like the licorice seeds I bought was from another store. I also found some real pretty burgundy sunflower seeds that I hope do well for us. So far, the only sunflowers that have done really good for us are the Lemon Queen, and I hope to put some of those up on my store this year. I haven't done that yet. I don't know why because I always save a bunch, but I do plan to put those up. I do plan to put uh, some of our pea seeds up this year, our, our snow peas, 
and possibly some of my runner bean seeds depending on how much I get. I've got a bunch out there that are maturing that I'm waiting to get to that point. I do have a bunch saved up from previous years that I'll probably save for myself and then possibly put up the ones I get from this year up on the store. But again, no promises, but be watching for those. If they go up, it'll probably be late fall, maybe early winter by the time I get them up, maybe even later than that. They'll definitely have them up around uh, on or by January. So just, just be watching and if that's something you're interested in. But anyway, what we're looking at is just a lot of supply and demand going on. So just keep hunting around, just like with the vacuum sealer lids, like I said in a previous video, just keep hunting around and keep checking back. Just because a place is out at one time, like for example, just like with me, we have so many things up on our store that uh, if I'm not paying attention, that uh, I sell out and I just it doesn't mean that we can't put more up like I might have more seeds that we can process and put up on the store so if we sell out a marshmallow seed that's one thing marshmallow and feverfew is one thing we seem to never run out of I always collect a lot of those so if it says that we're sold out it might simply mean that it just things it got away from us and we just need to get back to getting some more seed processed up and packaged up and then put up on the store so it could just be checking back to see if they're there i know that's been the same issue with the food saver top you can check on amazon but you have to check every single week or go check at foodsaver.com but keep checking every week just because they're not available one week doesn't mean they're not available the next okay well i hope that helps and again, Etsy's been my number one place to buy seeds that I don't already have or sell on my own store. Oh, and don't forget to check out my playlist of other FAQs that I'll be putting in the description box down below. Don't forget to click on either show more or the little gray arrow if you're on a smart device just below the video screen to open up that description box and see all the many links and to videos, sites, and other things that we'll be putting down below. All right, well, thanks for watching. Take care and God bless.